as you know in 2004 december the great uh, tsunami engulfed the entire indian ocean region uh, almost uh, 3 lakh uh, people were perished in this uh, tsunami in india itself uh, about 30000 people we lost uh, in andaman nicobar islands as well as um, in uh, tamil nadu coast and kerala coast there were no warning systems in place in uh, indian ocean and uh, enough warning couldn't be given to the indian ocean uh, countries about this impending uh, tsunami which followed after the mega earthquake that occurred uh, uh, of the sumatra coast so after the uh, devastation government of india decided that uh, we should have a national uh, tsunami warning uh, system and that gave birth to the this uh, tsunami warning uh, uh, center 1640 hours indian standard time an underwater earthquake shook the islands of indonesia the magnitude was 8.4 on the richter scale the ocean showed all the signs of leading to a tsunami the andaman and nicobar islands that were nearest to the epicenter were put on alert initially but after analyzing the real time water level data from tide gauges and the bprs it was evident that only a minor tsunami was generated models at incois indicated that the southern part of the country would experience a minor tsunami these regions were then placed on alert it takes just 3 hours for a tsunami wave to reach the shores of india from indonesia and 3 hours later the beaches of chennai witnessed a tsunami only that this time it was not dangerous the tsunami had lost its force This time no lives were lost. There was victory at Encoys. It's a very challenging thing actually uh, as a technology. Uh, you need you have data coming in from a huge number of real time stations about 300 to 400 stations pumping data into the early warning center in real time in various formats various uh, reporting frequencies uh and in various sizes so all this data has to be collected in real time at the tsunami early warning center it has to be processed it has to be displayed in real time and you need to take decisions based on certain scientific decision support rules to be able to generate alerts warnings and watches we faced uh, several um, tsunami genesis earthquakes uh, which had occurred in the indian ocean and uh, the warning center uh, did a good job in uh, Uh, providing the inputs so that uh, the disaster management agencies and um, the state governments can act uh, um, and take appropriate steps to protect the lives of the citizens